Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. Welcome to week seven. We are one week away from the bye week in the Eagles season. We are going up against the Carolina Panthers this week. I'm going up against Cam Newton. Matthews is going up against Benjamin. We gonna go long all day, man. I'm just let y'all know now, there is no fear in my eyes. Let's get into the game. All right, so to start things off, I decide, you know, we got to sustain the drive. And I'm just going to run a little bit of play action here. But check this out. As the rollout comes, the defense bombards my offensive line and I get sacked. I didn't have time to throw the ball away on that play. And it's going to be like that all game. So it's third and long. I decided to run the same play that I ran when I got sacked. And I finally meet up with Cooper. Me and Cooper had a long talk after last game. And... You know, I kind of decided I'm going to give him another chance. You know, I know he likes to bet on himself. And, hey, if he doesn't do well this game, he's going to go broke. But check me out, get sacked again. I don't know what it is, man. The Carolina Panthers defensive line is insane. But I decided to let Sproles run the ball, and he gets yards that is definitely needed. Everybody meets the goal. The goal is completed for this drive. And just to let you guys know, we are always about moving the chains. It's third and one. No fourth down here. I decide to scramble out of the pocket. And look at me get these extra yardage. Twinkle toes. Let's go. We are now close to the red zone. One yard away. Ah, things are just looking so great. Now, it's second and ten. On the first down, I couldn't get nothing done there. I'm going to just let y'all know now, man. Carolina is not to be played with. I roll out of the pocket again. And check it out. They running a QB spy or something because they are watching me like a hawk. Now, I'm going to let y'all know now, man. It's third and seven. If I don't get this conversion, I'm going to kick the field goal. I'm just going to let you guys know now because I'm not that type of guy that's going to be going for it on fourth on the first drive of the game. You got to set the tone with some points on the board at least. And here, I drop back a little bit too much, and they swat the ball away. Luckily, it wasn't an interception. Man, I don't know what I would have done if I would have threw away an interception right there. But the kicking team comes out. And, of course, you know, they're going to do what they're going to do because it's not me controlling the kick. <laughs> if you guys seen the video against me and Wiser now, man, I tried to kick a field goal and that thing went way left. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. But end of the first quarter is almost coming, man. You know, going to let them kick it away, see what the offense can do for Carolina. They can't put no points on the board, man. It's going to get ugly. Because I'm telling you now, I put points on the board. Now, they didn't get anything on their first possession. And they were stopped short. And he had to go for a nice little uh, punt. And I'm going to throw a little lob pass right here. I didn't want to throw a bullet pass because usually bullet passes get swatted away or intercepted. I don't know, man. I don't know what it is about bullet uh, passes and people on slants and, and uh, curls and all that. I don't know. But check it out. Throwing a nice little uh, screen right here. I know you guys are probably going to be like, hey, man, it's time for you to start calling more plays. It's time for you to go in a different formation. iPod, why are you doing this, man? It's the same old plays over and over. But ain't I supposed to go with what works? Like, I'm just, I'm just asking, like, shouldn't I use what works? But moving down the field, moving all along, it's third and two. We're in the red zone. I know what a lot of people are thinking. He ain't going to convert. He ain't going to convert. Well, check it out. I'm converting to my man Cooper. You know what I'm saying? Nice little uh, comeback. Hey, I needed that right there, man. Needed that right there. That's his third reception. I told you guys. I'm going to use Cooper a little bit more. You know what I'm saying? I made him bet half a mil on this game. So, you know, making it do what it do. But I got Matthews cutting across the middle. He makes the catch, gets the touchdown. And look at this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. A little bit of fire in his eyes. Hold on. We're going to have to run that back. I need you guys to check this out. Look at this. So, Matthews catches the pass. Okay. And let's see what the defender does here. Okay. So, he, he pats him on the back. Okay. Excessive padding. Oh, what is this dude doing? You want to get punched. Oh, I know, what, I know what he's doing. He wants us to get a penalty here. No, no, no. We much smarter than that, brother. Way smarter than that. But check it out. Moving along in the second quarter. We got a minute 43 left. You know, two-minute drill real quick. Got to get a touchdown here. It's only right. I'm just changing things up. And Matthews told me right out the gate, throw it to your boy. He said he's not playing with these fools, man. He's not playing at all. He said they want to mess with me. 
we gonna hurt them on the field. That's it. That's all we gonna do. So I throw a nice little uh, lob pass here to my man. You know what I'm saying? And oh yeah, somebody got teabag. That's not my fault though. That's not my fault, man. Teabag alert. Teabag alert. I'm just saying. Teabag alert. <laughs> Didn't have a chance there. But moving along down the field, drive goal is completed. You know what I'm saying? But we still gotta get a touchdown, man. We still gotta set the tone here. If we can go into the half with a 13-0 or a 17-0 lead, I will be happy and check it out. Riley Cooper diving for it. Remember when I told you last game he was out here point shaving, not getting allowed yards for me for passing. Now he's diving for the ball, making one hand catches. This is the Riley Cooper that I'm used to. Not that dude I seen last game. I'm just saying. Now, the second and goal. We're on a three yard line. Now, has anybody ever been cheesed by the play clock? Like, I know this is not me getting cheese, but basically I was trying to pick the right play to get Murray in the end zone. And what happened was I just didn't even look at the play clock. We catch a delay of the game on me. I'm a fool for what I did. I don't know what I was thinking, man, but we got to move back five yards. And this right here is an opportunity for me to take Murray right into the end zone with a running play. Now, I know a lot of people are thinking, but it's, it's like eight whole yards. But check out how we split the defense and get the blocking that we needed. What I did was I just called the play where it's like a little delayed handoff. And it just opens it up because what happens is the linebackers actually have to follow the receivers that are out on the outskirts. So, you know, we do what we had to do. But this is the time in the game where all hell breaks loose. So, it's 4th and 23 on this play, right? What happened was your boy got sacked a couple times. Yeah, um, Carolina defense decided to step it up in the second half. And they was putting me on my ass. I'm just going to go ahead and say it. They were putting me on my ass. Right here is 4th and 10. We only got one completed pass out of this play. And you guys told me, stop running the screen pass. Stop doing the same old plays. And, of course, we caught another 4th down. So, as we kick that one away... They return for four yards, but it ain't over. Oh, it's not over, man. Fourth and 27. What the hell is happening to iPod King Carter? Your boy is getting sacked like crazy. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I caught another sack, man. It, it, hey, look. Look, it's, it's not my fault, man. My offensive line is not able to stop Carolina's defensive line, and your boy has been getting sacked. I haven't been throwing the ball away or nothing, but check it out, man. We're in the red zone. I don't know how we caught this break. I think that Carolina went for it on fourth down and actually got a turnover on downs. And we're going to go ahead and take advantage of this. I just run up the middle real quick and we catch a flag already. Couldn't even get those yards that we needed, man. We catch a flag on the eight yard line. It's okay, man. I'm not going to trip about it. All I need here is a touchdown to basically put this game away, put the nail in the coffin. And we're going to try to get it here, man. Two minute warning. Carolina has all three timeouts. But it doesn't matter, man. As long as I get a touchdown here, we got nothing to worry about. And look, look at the play clock. Got way more than a lot of time that I need. Got 28 seconds left. And it's third and goal. We need something here. So I'll go ahead and pass it to Murray. And Murray gets the touchdown that we needed. Yeah. What y'all know about going for a rush on third and goal? They think and pass, but we think and rush. They was thinking, pa I know they was thinking pass. But check it out, man. This is IKC signing out. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, subscribe, comment, share on Facebook and Google Plus. Do what you do. I holla. Jello Beats, holla at me.